if I wasn't privy to. I'm not, I wasn't privy to it downstairs. Hi, Wolfgar. Nova kid. Oh my god, don't speak. Don't speak. You made the foundations tremble because your voice is so powerful. Don't tell me cause it hurts. Okay, I don't know where this is. Oh, in the High Hrothgar Courtyard, I see. It's in the courtyard. What the fuck? Eh? Where though? Oh, since he's back in there now. Is arm gear? Maybe. Oh, what the hell? The Tower of Power. He's not up in a Tower of Power, is he? Nobody's in this Tower of Power. I heard about here. Practicing. I heard somebody do a, a shout out here. But who could it be? Nova Kid. Where is he? Look at the marker. I'm looking at the fucking marker, guys. Oh, he is up here. Some fucking tower of power. How do I get up there? Is there a door? Oh, there you are, you son of a bitch. You came out of the tower of power, I think. Oh, there is an entrance. Oh, wait. Argir? So, you spoke to Parton. Yes. The dragon blood burns bright That's within you. Did he tell you what you wanted to know? Did he teach you the dragon ren to shout? Of course he did. So be it. If he believes it is necessary for you to learn this, we will bow to his wisdom. I need the Elder Scroll the ancients used. Do you know where to find it? We have never concerned ourselves with the scrolls. The gods themselves would rightly fear to tamper with such things. Right. As for where to find it, such blasphemies have always been the stock and trade of the mages of Winterhold. Right. They may be able to tell you something about the Elder Scroll you seek. Right, okay, sure. Thanks so much, Arngear, for that. Um, so we have to go to Winterhold now. Who was Jurgen Windcaller? He was a great war leader of the ancient Nords, the master of the voice or tongue. After the disaster at Red Mountain, where the Nord army was annihilated, he spent many years pondering the meaning of that terrible defeat. He finally came to realize that the gods had punished the Nords for their arrogant and blasphemous misuse of the voice. He was the first to understand that the voice should be used solely for the glory and worship of the gods, not the glory of men. Jürgen Windcaller's mastery of the voice eventually overcame all opposition and the way of the voice was born. Who the hell is practicing Fuz Rodaz down there? Win. <laughs> Winterhold apparently we have to go to, but let's check out this tower. What? He was up here, I see. The tower of power just leads you up here so that you can get a better view. Of all the guys training their thumes. Oh, look at this guy. Meditating. That's nice. So we have to go to Winterhold, apparently. We actually have to go to Winterhold and learn the location of the Elder Scroll. We have to be careful as well, because when we get here, I'm sure we're going to get attacked by a dragon. Remember when we did all the Archmage stuff? Old Beardo? Oh yeah, we'll probably see him, actually. Should we go take a look? Take a look at old Beardy Boy. Old Beardo. 
cross the bridge at your own peril. The Excuse way is dangerous me? and the gate My will not open. Hey Sips, you shall not gain entry. this is the first time I've ever watched a stream live. Been watching you for almost six years. Now I'm getting older Never and wondering. Is it worth having kids? What's the worst thing your kids have ever done? Oh, one time my son sprayed poop all up the wall of his bedroom. I mean, he was like one or something at the time. Maybe not even, actually. But that was probably the worst goddamn thing ever. A blood dragon. Made a small Reddit post on standalone housing mods you would like that have tons of storage. Okay. Maybe chat us some ideas also. Okay. Thanks to Rapid Raccoon and Josh Davies. Josh Davies. Thanks so much for the donation as well, man. I appreciate it. Oh, it looks like we're having a tussle with the dragon here. I knew this was gonna happen. God, you know what we need? No! Not the fire one. I was thinking more like, let's go for the clear skies. Let's clear up the skies around here so it's not so snowy in winter mode. Can that happen? Alright, Majul. Let's try to ground him. Let's try to ground his ass. Alright, let's do it. Kind of works. Stop the snow. We cleared up the skies. Look at that! That's nuts! This guy never lands. <laughs> All these archers. Don't even say anything. How about that? I just killed a dragon right in front of all your dumb faces. Okay, where were we? Oh, yeah, we were talking to this lady here. Hello. How are you? Welcome to the College of Winterhold. I am Feralda, one of the senior wizards here. I trust you found your journey to Winterhold not entirely unpleasant. Now, you I must your advise turn. you that if your only purpose in being here is to complain, you would be far better off speaking with the Jarl of Winterhold. If, however, you seek something more, I will be happy to assist you. Uh, why would I want to complain about the college? It is no great secret that we have been unjustly blamed for a great many things over the years. The good people of Skyrim, on occasion, would rather pass judgment than attempt to understand what we do here. Right. Thus, we must take certain precautions in order to secure our safety. Okay, so there you have a strict... We don't allow complainers into the college. May I enter? Perhaps. But what is it you expect to find within? I'm kind of looking for an Elder Scroll. Do you? Yeah. It is true, there are some here who have spent years studying the accumulated knowledge of the scrolls. But what you seek does not come easily, and can destroy those without a strong will. It would seem that the college has what you seek. The question now is what can you offer the college? Nothing. Not just anyone is allowed inside. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. A small I'm test, a if you will. 
I think we both know I'll succeed here. No, I'm afraid I don't know anything of the sort. What? Would you grant entry to the Dragonborn? Dragonborn? Yeah? It's been so long since we've had any contact with the Greybeards. Do you really have the voice? Yeah. I would be most impressed to see that. Which one do you want me to do? How about this one? Look! So the stories are true. That's right. You are Dragonborn. Normally, you'd need to show some aptitude with one of the schools of magic. But you... I think there is much that we can learn from each other. I think you'll be a superb addition to the college. Welcome, apprentice. Woo! I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabel Irvine, our master wizard. Please, follow me. Hey, I think we cleared the skies even more than, than before, right? Look at how, look, it's glorious out here with the sun. It's actually kind of nice. Shit. Let's just give it another one and see what happens. Oh. Fuck yeah. God, I like screaming at the air. That's fantastic. Oh my god, I forgot how treacherous this whole path is. Oh shit. I think that's him. Is it? Oh no, it's not. He's got like a different a different cloak, doesn't he? Who's this? Onmund. I don't remember him. Brelia, I, I remember. Rather clear. Yes, of it's course. Ancano. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to. Hey the guys, listen to this. To your oh. Oh. No such treatment. No. You are a guest of the college here at the pleasure of the Archmage. Oh shit, the weather's gone all shitty again. I appreciate the opportunity. Yes, of course. The Maybe you just do like a mini one. Place. Ready? There <laughs> Hey! <laughs> it worked! Mirabel? Welcome to the college. I was told to come see you. Another new student. Well. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I doubt I'll that. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Sorry, I'm not ready for that just yet. I see. Well... Please let me know when you are. Oh, yeah, okay, thanks. The Hall of Elements. I remember all this. I remember Anaconda and all of these guys. Oh, I remember this fucking old guy too. Welcome, welcome. We were just beginning. Please, stay and listen. No thanks. So, as I was saying... I got lots of shit to do, actually. The Arcaniorium. That's where we need to go. We have to go find out about the Elder Scrolls now. Oh yeah. I remember this guy too. The old librarian. I don't want to... You are now in the Arcanium, of which I am in charge. It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion. Nice. Disrupt my Arcanium, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronox. Alright. Now... Do you require assistance? Yes. I am. Uh, I, are there any? Uh, what? What have you got for? I'm looking for an Elder Scroll. And what do you plan to do with it? Do you even know what you're asking about? I'm going to travel time, actually. Are you just someone's actually. errand boy? Tell me more about the Elder Scrolls. I knew it. Everyone comes in here expecting my help, but they don't even have the proper questions. An Elder Scroll is an instrument of immense knowledge and power. To read an Elder Scroll, a person must have the most rigorously trained mind, or else risk madness. Even so, the Divines usually take the reader's sight as a price. A price for what? Who wrote the Elder Scrolls? It would take a month to explain to you how that very question doesn't even make sense. <laughs> the scrolls exist here, with us, but also beyond and beneath, before and after. They are bits of divine made substance, so we could know them. Right. Sorry, talking about the scrolls, you usually end up in irritating and vague metaphors like that. Some people who study them devoutly go mad. Gotcha. All right. So, do you have one that I could use? Ah, 
You think that even if I did have one here, I would let you see it? It would be kept under the highest security. The greatest thief in the world wouldn't be able to lay a finger on it. Test me. Why don't you test me? What about the Dragonborn? What about... Wait, are you... Were you the one the Greybeards were calling? I'll bring everything we have on them, but it's not much. So don't get your hopes up. It's mostly lies, leavened with rumor and conjecture. Okay. Great. That would be really good. Um, this is quite an impressive library, actually. A mage is only as good as what he knows. I try to make sure as much knowledge is available as possible. We've been keeping this collection since the second era. I've got quite a Hopes large collection myself, actually. I'm a private collector. But it's mostly intact. Hey, Sips. Hey. Greetings all the way from Washington State. Hey. Been watching since the Sips Company days with Sjin and thought it was about time to show my appreciation for the work you put in to keep us entertained. Oh, thanks, man. Thanks, Sipsy. Big women, big money, big fun. Brock, thanks so much for the donation, man. I appreciate it. What have you actually got for sale? You take your work very seriously. <clears throat> okay, go get me the Elder Scrolls stuff. Is a perfectly valid school of magic, and don't let anyone tell you otherwise. What the fuck? You've been there the whole time? Listening to my conversation? I recently interviewed a potential new employee, and, and goddamn, he sounded exactly like Zargo. He couldn't understand what I was laughing out, but I almost hired him immediately because of it. <laughs> Thanks, Achievement Hunt Why Mal. Okay. Why are my research materials constantly disappearing? I don't want to see you treating any of these books poorly. I... Are we clear? Do you know what? Fuck off. Okay, here we go. Discerning the Transmundane. We can take this one. This is the insane book. Effects of the Elder Scrolls. It is widely known among scholars that the Elder Scrolls entail a certain hazard in their very reading. The mechanism of the effects has, at present, been largely unknown. Theories of hidden knowledge and divine retribution were the subject of idle speculation with little investigation. Nice. So wait, you can go nuts by reading one. Holy crap. Now this is a book. This is definitely one we need for the collection. Hey. Hundreds of years have gone into assembling this collection. It's going to stay pristine, understand? Okay, this Ruminations book is incomprehensible. Aye, that's the work of Septimus Cygnus. He's the world's master of the nature of Elder Scrolls. But, well, he's been gone for a long while. Too long. What do you mean? Where did he go? Somewhere up north. In the ice fields. Oh, for fuck's he sake. He said he found some old Dwemer artifact. But, well, that was years ago. Ugh. Haven't heard from him since. Okay. I guess we have to go find Septimus Cygnus now. Majol. We've got our marching orders. It's been a resounding success coming to the College of Winterhold. That's right. Once again, I have found very... Nobody cares. Just because I don't fit oh, in here, for no fuck's reason sakes. for others to ridicule oh. me behind my back. Hold up a second. Beardo, are you in here? He's not. <laughs> oh shit, he is. Oh fuck. Uh. <laughs> I remember a cut first. <laughs> there he is. Look. When I oh, myself, as I live and breathe! His armor. He's got so many soul gems in here. Look at all these dildos that he keeps in his display case. Hi, well. Sips. Been watching since 10,000 BC, and I just wanted to say if you're not going to charge the Nightingale Bow, you may as well use the glass one, you absolute sausage gobbler. Been okay. trying to hold it, but it's been three days without charge now. I don't need a charge. This doesn't do shit. Freezes the target for 15 points and shocks the target for 7 points. Who cares? Look, we'll charge it up, okay? We'll charge it up. It doesn't matter. We just we just want to one-shot everything, right? No? Cue the Beardo music? I don't have it. I don't even remember what it's called. Please don't bother the archer. Great music, though. Oh, yeah. No, no, I didn't. I just went in to look at him a little bit. 
and I stole from him as well. Okay, so we have to go find, apparently, um, Septimus Cygnus, who was in the ice fields to the north. Where is Septimus Cygnus now, I wonder? He could be anywhere. Find Septimus Cygnus and learn the location of the Elder Scroll. They're both in the same goddamn place. Holy shitballs. Alright, let's go. Let's go. We're gonna go find it. I can almost see it from here. Thanks to my clear... Oh, shit. I forgot about that, too. God, guys, there's so many things that we still need to do in this game. It's nuts, isn't it? Oh, hey. Thanks for the tour, by the way. Fat lot of good you were. Jeez. Alright, this is all charged up now. I love the cloaks look so good, don't they? Holy crap. What a great mod. What a fantastic mod. Okay, we should be good to go. I don't think we need to do any any prep. I don't think we need to do any preparations. Look! There. Take that weather. Eat my shit. That's right. I made the weather eat my shit. Check this out. Got him. Direct hit. That's a mangy wolf. A mangy ice wolf at that. Wait, what are all these places over here? Oh look, the ice looks so cool, doesn't it? There's some sort of like temple or something over here. Maybe it's a new yell. I'm interested to get more yells actually. I want to upgrade some of my other yells. Maybe this game isn't all just about Fus Roda. Maybe there's more to it. Maybe I don't I don't realize. There's just a lot more to it than just the Fus Roda. Don't, I like the I like a good old fashioned Fus Roda, but maybe there's just more. Maybe there's a better shout out there. No? There are yells in virtually every single Nord room. This is good to know. What? <laughs> oh no. We've been detected by a horker. <laughs> oh my god, look at his dumb face. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh, Jesus! Oh. Okay, good. We're going in undercover. <laughs> We're swimming out here. Wait, have we done this before? This seems familiar, actually. Oh, I love this clipping that I'm doing here as well, right through all the ice. No problem. This seems a bit familiar, actually. Done. Or is this, or is it, am I thinking of that lighthouse? Remember that lighthouse? That I died in like a million times? It's a really tough one. Septimus Cygnus' outpost. Alright, let's be very careful, Majol. You never know what's down here. Oh, fuck, I remember this. I think I remember this. I think we did this. I think we already did this. Big dwemer in the beyond. I'll know your lost unknown. When the top level <laughs> was built, eh? no more could be placed. It was and is the maximal apex. I heard you know about Elder Scrolls. Elder Scrolls, indeed. The Empire, they absconded with them. Or so they think. The ones they saw. Ah, the ones they thought they saw. I know of one. Forgotten. Sequestered. Is it the but time I one? I cannot go to it. Not poor Septimus. For I, I have arisen beyond its grasp. Um, where is it? Here. No way. Well, here as in this plane. 
Mondas, Tamriel, nearby, relatively speaking. <laughs> On the cosmological scale, well, it's all nearby. Can, can you help me get it? One block lifts the other. Septimus will give what you want, but you must bring him something in return. Is it Majol? You see this masterwork of the Dwemer, deep inside their greatest oh, knowing. Oh fuck! If he needs like power cores, Septimus I've dropped so is many of those. Clever among men, but he is but an idiot child compared to the dullest of the Dwemer. Lucky then they left behind their own way of reading the Elder Scrolls. Right. In the depths of Black Reach, one yet lies. Black Reach. Have you heard of Black Reach? Oh, I think I've Cast been there the actually. Where City slept, the yearning spire, hidden learnings kept. That's like really deep down underground, isn't it? We went Under there, didn't we? Deep below the dark, the hidden keep, tower Mazark. Of Pan, the point of puncture, a first entry of the tapping. Tapping. Delve to its limits. And Black Reach lies just beyond. But not I remember doing some of this. There. Only Septimus knows the hidden key to loose the lock to jump beneath the deathly rock. Wow, he's rhyming like crazy. How do I get in? Two things I have for you. Two shapes. One edged, one round. Okay. The round one for tuning. Dwemer music is soft and subtle. And needed to open their cleverest gates. Okay. The edged lexicon for inscribing. To us, a hunk of metal. To the Dwemer, a full library of knowings, but empty. Find Mazark and its sky dome. The machinations there will read the scroll and lay the lore upon the cube. Trust Septimus. He knows you can know. Alright. Fine. Good. I have to go recover the Elder Scroll. Wow. Let's do it. Let's fucking do it, Majol. We, we got it. We've got... We've got the fucking... We've, we've got it. Whoa. We gotta take some of those fire salts for Balamunt. We have another quest for those things, right? Might as well while we're here. Grab them. I think that puts our total for fire salts up to about five fire salts. Possibly. Alright, where is this place? We have to go to a sky dome. We have to go to some sort of sky dome. It's here. Alfdand. We've not been to Alfdand yet. Have we been to Yingvild? No. Have we even been to Dawnstar yet? No. We have to start from Winterhold. Oh, you know what? I think this place... I think... Didn't we get, like, the... Isn't, like, the fucking, um... Staff of, uh, Magnus there or something? Am, am I... God might get nervous. Am I tripping out? This weapon gone. I'm pretty sure I'm tripping. Disrespect the law. Alphand. I, I seem to remember doing this before. All right, Majol, on me. Let's move out. Was it? Did we go here for the for the um, for the Archmage quest or something? I think we might have. You know. I think we might have. No. Oh. All the runes are the same. Yeah, I did a quest for Septimus before. Oh, did I? I I remember him a little bit, but not not much. Actually, the bit that was familiar was that big fucking gyro thing. Isn't this place like just here? No, it's still further along actually. Man, guys, it was so long ago. It was like five years. Like, I don't remember much of it at all. Ah! <laughs> 
delicate prancing. This is Achievement Hunt Mal coming to you live from the Nordic News. Glaciers are melting in the north more now than ever. Eyewitnesses are said to be in a state of shock after a spell of clear skies is refusing to dissipate. Locals are expecting floods. It was me. It was me. I melt all the glaciers out here. I love this, the clear sky shout. I think that's fantastic. I don't love it enough to get off my horse and cast it right now, though. That's for damn sure. I think this place is just in here. Am I heading the right way? Yep. Yepers! Alright, pony. Ouch. There's gonna be bandits and shit, aren't there? Maybe there's like a secret, like sneaky way in that I can like lock pick my way into. How awesome would that be? Oh shit. I don't know if it's wait, is this a way? Alftan Ruin Tower. Maybe we can get up from here. Ah, oh, fucking Dwemer ruins. Jesus. Ah! Joel. trapped down here otherwise. So if we go through this tower, we might be able to get to where we need to go and find a whole bunch of awesome treasures. Awesome treasures along the way. That's generally how it works, right? have to turn this on and just go through it, I think. Ah! Ugh. Watch out, there's traps all over the place in here. Don't you dare s trigger any of these... Oh, crap. I got a dwarven spear on me, Majol. Get in there. Got it. Got it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at this, it's like a store. Oh fuck, they had stores and everything? Man, the dwarves knew like what was up, right? They knew how to live. They definitely knew how to live down here. Oh yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Whoops. 
Thanks for re-addicting me to Skyrim. After two days of solid modding between not writing my university dissertation at all, and getting over 200 mods to be compatible with each other, I'm done. It'll be in my cardboard box waiting to fail. Sincerely, you Mafia UK. Mafia UK, thanks so much, man. You don't wanna... So, this is a thing that I... Shit, this is a thing I come across a lot with people. They, like, they... They go to play Skyrim, and they spend, like, two days modding it. And then after they're done modding it, they don't feel like playing it anymore. <laughs> it's pretty funny. I say just play the game. Right. From scratch. And then mod as you go. So then you can get into it a little bit. And then you know what mods you need, rather than just installing, like, 200 mods, like, from the get-go. Right? You think so? You've done that? That's a common thing to, to, to happen. Aha! It worked, boys. Look, we're up. We got up to the top, which is where we wanted to go. That was not the right shout. That was not the right shout at all. You can't do a... It turns out you can't Fuz Rodad the sky to clear the weather. Who'd have thought? Majol's just back there chatting away like... Like it ain't no thing. Okay, we've discovered Alf... Alftand. Alf... Alftand. Alftand. And a bandit camp as well. Looks like there might be some bandits active in the area. Or maybe there were some bandits active in the area. No longer. Looks like they've all been torn asunder. Those are some charred up bodies, big time. Oh, what's this? An expedition manifest. We've managed to secure the site and hold off any others who may try to steal our discovery so far, especially those from the College of Winterhold, who seem to think the glory of exploring every ruin should be theirs alone. The crew for our expedition is as follows. Sula Trebatius, expedition leader. Umana, my constant companion and bodyguard. Vali, a mage not associated with Winterhold. Andrast, a fellow explorer of some local renown. Yag, a great brute of a woman. Hard to keep the rest of the labor in check. And Jadar and Jazar, two Khajiit brothers. Hard as labor. Need a couple more laborers. Getting through the ice is proving difficult. We've set up shelter and scouted the area. The small ruins on the lower plateau of the glacier don't seem connected to the main structure. We haven't managed to find a way into the tower parapet we've found here. Yag mentioned spotting a fissure in the glacial wall that may lead into the ruins, so we're going to try to find a way to get down there with the gear. Looks like a storm is coming. Okay, good to know. Good, good ship. Fuck. That was a, that was a good ship to know, actually. Ancestors and the Dumber. We don't need to know that one. Oh, I think this is the way out. I think this might be the way out. Is it lockpickable? No, it doesn't seem to be. You gotta open it with the, um, with the lever, right? How the fuck do you get in this place? If not up here, where exactly? Whoa, where must I go? Oh, maybe it's through this way. Oh, I see. We gotta go like, down here. Ah, uh, I see it. I see it, boys. Don't worry. You gotta follow this way. Uh, here we go. The glacial ruins. This is the way to go. Is it gonna be filled with vampires? blood in here. Lots of blood indeed. And some sort of massacre. Last year on this date you were playing Polybridge and wished me and Janet a happy wedding day. Today hey. is our one year anniversary. Oh fuck. We made it dad. Congrats Jeffrey. Where is it? I know you were trying to keep it for yourself Jesus. You always try to keep it for yourself. No. There's got to 
They're they're addicted to skooma. These guys are addicted to skooma. I can hear them. They're having a fight over there about skooma. They must have killed everybody. They must have come down here and just killed everyone. Jazar and his brother Bazaar. No? Jeffrey, good job, Ben. Really proud of you and Janet. One year. Wait till you get to seven years and you get the seven year itch. Then get back to me. See if you guys are still going then, okay? That one's brutal. Nah, I'm just joking. <laughs> Everybody makes a big deal about it, but honestly. Oh, there's some research notes here. If only Umano would have left one of these dwarven machine creatures intact for me to study. The fact they almost killed those Keshi brothers in the middle of the night doesn't mean we couldn't have found a way to disable one. We dragged some stuff in front of the pipes. They came out of the top uh, off of to stop them from coming back. Oh, okay, yes, yeah, see. They're simply fascinating. It's just as Calcimo described in Dwarves Volume 2. Their appearance does, in fact, resemble that of an arachnid. I uh, thought to be that to be an embellishment given by his source. The inclusion of the soul gem into the design of the apparatus is quite remarkable. It could explain the focus for the lightning that he describes. Oddly enough, it doesn't appear to be the main power source for the apparatus. Perhaps some sort of harmonic resonance within the energies contained in the soul gem to bring heat to a small boiler? Too early to say conclusively. That does raise the question of where they get the liquid for the boiler, however. Huh, that was strange. I thought I just saw something moving beyond the barred door. It looked vaguely humanoid. I wonder if it could be an undiscover uh, automaton. I'm going to move my bedroll down here to see if I can catch another glimpse of it. This is all so exciting. Uh oh. A humanoid on the other side. Valmer, maybe? How do we get in here? Is there a button? A Joel? See anything? Button. chest here. It's way over here. Yeah. Don't worry, Majol, I got it. Maybe we gotta find these brothers. Are they up here? I heard them talking, like, around here somewhere. Find these these Skuma brothers. It sounded like they were in here, possibly, or like down this down here. Okay, we're gonna find them, and when we do, fuck, somebody's gotta have some answers. Bam. These are the blood trails, still, right? Who is this man? Another of the smooth skins looking for food? This one doesn't talk to us. No! You must be the one who took my skooma. Someone there? It wasn't me! <laughs> I think Jadar is just like fucking talking to a dead brother. Jazar. He went nuts. All he could talk about was skooma. way to like if I had like a calm spell or something could I have talked to him no it wasn't me no it wasn't me you won't catch me doing this you won't catch me doing any skooma that's what I'm ooh ebony ore nice that's gotta be worth something right Around 
so fast. Out. No fire in here. The whole place is gonna go up. I can see the vents. novice. No problem. This one's apprentice. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my lord. It's gotta be this way, right? Aha. Stuff, Majol. Just think, we could have such a pimped out house if it was just me and you who were married and not me and stupid Camilla running her dumb flower shop. All she does is just run that stupid flower shop. Wow. Elven Sword of Blizzards. Nice. Actually, we kind of need some money now, don't we? So we should probably pick up like a couple bits and pieces. Am I right? Are we even going the right way here? It's like that way. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Maybe we get like over here. Maybe we have to go this way, right? here though. charge my uh, bow as well, I guess, eh? Yeah, I need to level up too. Um, let's go for health. Archery. Oh my god, look at this, guys. Shit. We need a hundred for this to work now. We got everything, though. We done it. Light armor, sneak, lock picking, pickpocket we were working on. We don't have enough pickpocketing to um, increase the piece though. Lock picking we do though. What's this one? Adept locks are much easier to watch, you know what? Do you know what? 
pickpocketing. That's another one we were working on, right? We don't have enough for it, though. Speech, alchemy, illusion, conjuration, destruction, restoration, alteration, enchanting. Anamonculary. Are we actually gonna get an Elder Scroll in here? Fuck. I think the only other Elder Scroll I got was in uh, huh? Dawnguard, possibly? I got one in Dawnguard. Maybe? Majol got pushed off. Ah, oh, shit. I knew it. I knew it. Falmer. with us, it's fine. Take that, bitch. Take that. Oh, no. Take that. Big bitch. Nice. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry I just left you behind. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to. Oh, gross. Look at this place. We venture deeper down. We have to use, like, uh, what did he say? We have to get something and then we have to, like, inscribe a cube with the knowledge of the Elder Scroll or something? Is that the equivalent of like putting it onto a USB drive? Is that what we're doing down here? That doesn't seem right, does it? Oh my god, we still fight. We're gonna get an action jacks in there too. So sad. So sad when it doesn't work. No. <laughs> the other USBs. That's exactly what it is here. Oh my god. Oh my god. A chest with two gold in it. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> I think it's like this. 
about it. <gasps> a Dwemer cloak. Purple. A skeleton. The locked room. Oh, nice. Nice. It's a master lock as well. Shit. This is my calling, guys. Oops. Luckily, I have a lot of... Oh, my God. We're sub-100 lockpicks now. Oh, my God. This one's so tough. I think it's like that. Oh, my God. We had it before, didn't we? Oh, I'm sure... I'm sure we it was around here, but maybe not. Oh my god, we're we're blasting through We're blasting through so many of these! Oh no! Oh shit! Oh no. Oh no! Oh, crap. Oh, come on. It's so sensitive. Oh, finally. <laughs> oh, my God. We finally found an amulet of Talos. Just crap though. Oh my god, all that. We did find an amulet of Talos though. Oh. Nice. Oh, can you believe that? <laughs> Worth it. Fuck's sake, that was the worst. I can't believe that. I cannot believe that. So, where do we have to go down more? like a natural way down though. It doesn't involve just like jumping around like a madman. What the hell was that? What on earth? Oh my god, there is a down. And they're fighting the automatons. They're fighting all the Oh my god. Are these guys blind? I guess they're Nice try, bitch. Nice try, you bitch. Ah ha ha! We got him. We got him before he could. Wait, so. Oh fuck! What was that? Oh shit! We're taking we're taking shots here. Oh, it's this guy. Ow! I thought it was the water for a sec. I thought the water was like poisonous or something. Turns out, no, it wasn't. It wasn't poison water at all. In fact, it was just an archer. Oh, watch out for this trap.
Yeah. I took, just left a whole bunch of fresh logs like right in his bed. Human flesh. That's disgusting. Oh, these things that they've left here, though. All good stuff. All stuff worth taking, right? Dishonored? Oh, Majol. I got you, don't worry. I'm helping. Oh, no, expert. Oh, shit. Better be worth it. Oh. Oh, what the fuck? It's like more this way, I think. Oh, okay, good. Oh my lord. <laughs> oh my god. Some of these chests just aren't even worth opening, are they? Joel, what are you doing? Hurry up! Stop fucking around back there! Look at all these mushrooms that they collect. Well, they're not going to need them now. I've never been a sensor. Never traded my skills for pay. Okay, Mitchell. I've always adventured on my own terms. Thanks for letting me know. We just want to go as low as we can, right? We want to go down, down, down into the um, into the um, underground to get the Elder Scroll or to get the cube thing. So we're just going as deep as we can go. Gotcha, don't worry. A human heart. Oh, we need a we need a um a, a Daedra heart, don't we? Valley. Oh yeah, Valley. Forgot about Valley. I guess they kidnapped all these people and have now killed them. They stole all of their, their good stuff, like a small pearl. Clothing and Got a lot of human flesh down here. Spider eggs and stuff too. Dead Falmer too though. No. You can turn the human heart into a Daedra heart? How? That sounds crazy. But this place is still going. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. <laughs> right into his soup. Oh, they got spiders down here too. How? How? How did that miss? Oh, god damn it. Take that. And that. And you could take one of these too. Nice. We're getting close now. We're getting down there. We're right at the bottom. 
Cobwebs and gross shit down here. Black Reach. I remember Black Reach. I remember finding it super duper impressive the first time we saw it. It's like this glowing underground cave, right? It's fucking cool. I think it might just be through here, actually. It doesn't just open up into it. Must be it. This opens up into it, right? Black I reach. Really miss traveling like this. Nope, this what? is the cathedral, apparently. What the fuck? Fuck me, I hope we don't have to come back down here for something else later. <laughs> Holy shit, this place is huge. Okay, don't step on the pressure pads, Majol. I told you not to. I definitely told you not to. Now you gotta pay the price. I think we're getting close now. Oh my god. The best guardsman ever. What a bunch of pianists. What the fuck is all this? Oh, there's a lever here. Aha. It opened the way. It opened up the way for us. Oh shit. When's the next XCOM playthrough? I have no idea, man. We'll play it again at some point though, I'm sure. It's creepy. Oh, there's an ebony bow here. Fuck, look at this damage. 69 damage. That's nuts. Holy jumping. Jehoshaphat's. Ebony bow. Is that good, guys? Yeah. I feel like it's pretty good. I'm happy with that. I'm glad we went up there. That was nice. What's this? Can't pick that up. Hey, Uncle Sips, a two parter, so a pregnant chick on the trip. The next her parents goes to see the local doctor's office to make sure the baby is alright and runs into an old friend from high school working at the front desk. Right. Right? He said. Is it just me? Or are these centurions like easier than fucking like the the sphere ball things? They are, aren't they? They are much easier. Oh, key to the elf elf tent lift. Nice. Her old friend, knowing her quite well, asks her if the pregnancy was a drunken joke gone wrong, and she replies that it was totally birth it. Super dude, 808. Why did you donate twice for that? Let's just get out of here. Hasn't there been enough death? Oh, of course, you want me to leave. Just waiting for me to turn my back, so you can have all the glory for yourself. Hey, what was that? Okay, let's kill the Imperial first. Scumbag. Come on, Umana. We want to be your. We want to be friends. It's too late. It's too late now. Take her down. <laughs> Good job. What's this? Tarch of the Blooded. Of the blooded. 
We haven't seen a shield like this yet. I'm sure we can find one out. I'm sure we can. I'm sure we can find one, right? I almost died in a ruin just like this. Wow. Check this out. Oh, shit. We done it. They're both unique. All oh, right. Okay. Huh? All right, guys. Sorry. Okay, okay. Take the shield. All right, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I didn't realize it was unique. It didn't look that unique to me. Okay. I'll take it, though. I'm taking it. What's the other one? Is there something else here? Oh, this is just crappy Imperial stuff, right? All right, boys. Calm down. I'm taking it, okay? Jesus. I'm not going to use it anyway. But I guess I could hang it up at home. I could hang it up at home. Okay, Black Reach. Sorry about that. Black Reach. Here it is. It's a really gross. It's like Subnautica down here. Ain't it? I remember all this. Vaguely. Not in like great detail. I remember being kind of scared down here and not wanting to spend too much time down here. God, he's got like a crossbow. Oh, fuck. Get out of my black reach. Just do it. Just get out. Oh yeah, there's all these like little houses and stuff. I think this is like a dwarven town. An old dwarven town. We've got Cinderion's Field Laboratory here. Let's see what's in here. Nernroot. Discover the significance of it. Oh! A Daedra Heart! Perfect! We found one, guys. Nice! Fire salts? Oh, shit, Majol. Here, Majol, please. Help her brother I'm out itching here. For a fight. No problem. I can carry a good bit of gear. Yeah. We got it. We done it. All right, you're gonna have to hold some of this stuff. It's so heavy. Got a lot of heavy shit here. Why do I have studded armor? Okay, hold this tarch. Hold a lot of this crap, actually. Not the mourner's hat, though. It's considered stolen. Oh yeah, Dwemer purple. I'll hang on to that. I'm gonna hang on to this amulet of Mr. T as well, actually. Um, Elven Sword of Blizzards. Take that. Ebony Bow? Mm. I think we use this instead of the Glass Bow, right? Which I don't seem to have one. Oh yeah, no, it was Soul Stealer 5 million, 61 damage. The Nightingale Bolt is 53 though, that's pretty good. All set, let's that's go. Nuts. What's a Crimson Nern Root do? Does anyone know? There's more Fire Salts here too, I think. Bone meal, ectoplasm, frost salts, moon sugar. Oh, the good shit. Nice. Man, this guy had it all. He's got soul gems. He's got an alchemy book here. He had that red nern root. What? There's a big orb in the sky. Try yelling some insults at it. All right, okay. Nice. We can actually do that. Who's Cinderian and why has he got a field journal here? Discover the significance of the Crimson Nernroot. Collect Crimson Nernroot in Black Reach. Oh my god. I've spent a large portion of my life unraveling the mystery of the Nernroot and yet I still feel unfulfilled. The, the trilling sound this strange herb emits seems to taunt me, to push me even harder to, to discover its secrets. Even after a generous and indomitable traveler became a field collector in my stead and provided me with five score of the Nern root, I was only able to muster what I consider a mediocre alchemical creation at best. This only served to strengthen my hunger and whet my appetite for the solution. 
It wasn't until over 50 years later that the answer to my prayers was carried into my basement workshop at the West Wheeled Inn. The first thing I heard was the familiar tone, that unmistakable warble unique to the Nern Root. But when I turned around, my heart leapt and a chill ran down my spine. This was indeed a Nern Root, but of a variety the likes of which I had never seen. The herb was awash in a spectacular array of red hues, each leaf seeming emblazoned with innumerable variations of crimson. I couldn't move. I was completely transfixed. Never in my wildest dreams could I have imagined a species of Nernroot with such a unique property. After an awkward silence, I finally managed to stammer out a few questions to the traveler who brought me this treasure. He told me his name was Obeth Arnesian, the treasure seeker from Skyrim. Apparently. He'd been exploring a vast subterranean network of grand caverns called Blackreach and had stumbled across what he dismissed as a noisy red weed. <laughs> His expedition was largely unsuccessful and he didn't want to leave the caves empty-handed, so Obeth picked up one of the crypts in Nernroot to bring home. He said that it took some time, but eventually he was pointed my way and that perhaps I'd pay a fair price for it. Before I could gather my wits and ask anything else, Obeth offered to sell me the Crimson Nernroot sample, a map showing me how to find Blackreach, the strange key needed to breach its outer defenses. It took me mere moments to decide Obeth left Skingrad a thousand septims richer, but I would have easily paid ten times that amount to obtain the sample alone. Oh my god, this is the longest fucking journal of all time. I mean, it was kind of interesting though. It's kind of interesting. For a while. It was interesting for a while. I even read that book for a while. But then it got really dumb, so I stopped reading that thing. And now here I am, carrying on with my life. Ho oh, oh, ho oh, ho oh. ho. Okay. Good, we have to collect like a million nerd roots now. No. Huh? Calm down, Majol. Alright? Just calm the hell down. We got Falmer down here, we got robots, we got everything, okay? Yes, we're gonna explore the place, but at the same time, come on now. Let's not get too ahead of ourselves, okay? This place is creepy as shit. Look at all this gross stuff on the ground here, too. Yuck. Yuck. How big is this place? Oh my god, it's huge. Look at the size of this. Wait, is that where we just were? Fuck's sake. Fuck you. Is, is there a way to, like, get to Blackreach? Like, to fast travel to it? Or should we do everything we can to find... To stay down here so we don't have to come back? Because fuck me, it took a long time to get down here. I hear one. <gasps> Got one. Got a night prowler here. Prowling through the night. Let's see if there's a secret chest behind this waterfall. Nope. No, it doesn't seem like there is one. What the fuck is that? Oh my god, that is cool. They got like Fallout style wasp things down here. Got another one. Okay, we found the edge of the cavern. This is a good thing, right? Oh my god, they're everywhere. Holy crap. Oh yeah, baby. It's not worth it. Why? What's the reward? Actually, don't spoil it. Sometimes, sometimes I'm up for doing stuff, sometimes I'm not. This feels like something I'd like to achieve. Because I feel like it's got to be worth it, right? Because we're down here in this place that is impossible to get back to. So while we're down here, we should do as much as we can. Like, mine that ore, whatever it is, because it's glowing. 
right? So here I go down here to mine that ore, whatever it is, because it's glowing. Quicksilver. Hell yeah. Man, we're gonna be so rich. It's gotta be worth it. You can go back at any time. There's a lift to fast travel. Oh, there is? Oh, okay. Alright, well still. Even though there's a lift to fast travel and stuff, I don't know if I necessarily want to come back down here. What's this geode vein? What do you get from this? A petty soul gem. Oh my god! A grand soul! Fuck me! And a greater one as well! That's crazy! You get soul gems from the geode ones, that's awesome! Holy shit! Got a free grand soul gem? It's not bad, eh? No? That's not too bad. Oh shit, what's that? God, that's disgusting. Oh my God, Mitchell, where are you? Holy crap, that's so gross. Oh, look at this. It's like some poison barf. It's barfing all over me in a poisonous way. Get him, Mitchell. That is so, so fucking gross. Holy shit. No thanks. What's that gigantic, like... I remember a cut purse trying to rob me on the road What once. is that thing? When I drew Grim Sever, I think the four men Is that like a power arm. source or something? I can hear one. Oh, I see one. Here, look. Silent Ruin? What is this? Warrior? Sure. Oh god, get out of the way quick! Another one. A silent ruin. Is this where the king sat? In his little little um, baby stool? Oh my god. How did this guy get to sneak on us? Hey Majol? How did it happen? Nice shot by the way. That's great. Why are Falmer arrows so terrible? Does anyone have the answer to that one? Oh shit, is that a giant? There's a fucking giant down here. Why is there a giant down here? No? You'd think that like... Because the Falmer are like hard to get to because they're like so deep underground and stuff that... Oh shit, Majol, what are you doing? Gotta be the dumbest son of a bitch. Oh my god, I fucking deserve that. Oh, nice. <laughs> fucking good. Steel cup boots. It's pretty cool down here, actually. It's a nice little adventure, isn't it? 
Is this the way out that you guys are talking about? The lift? Is this the way back in? Every time? Oh yeah, it is, guys. You're right. Fuck, that's awesome. Oh wait, we didn't come through this way, did we? Where does this lead to? Where the fuck does this go back to? We want to go up there? Shit on the floor. Oh my god! It all connects up! It's Michelin Schlaft or whatever. It's that other one that we were in. Yeah, that's the one that we got our sword from, remember? Fuck! That's crazy! This is nuts. Shit on the floor, okay. <clears throat> Michelin schlip. Michelin schlash schlip. Okay, I'm not actually leaving right now. But I just want to see if this is indeed a place that I can move. <laughs> If I can go back up and come back down whenever I want to. Because I think that would be handy. I think it would be pretty handy, actually. Mishlachling schlipschlacht. Oh, yeah. It's a black reach. Oh, oh there's a claustral. Watch out. Let's go. <laughs> okay. Perfecto. Perfecto. We can fast travel back here if we want to and find all the Nern roots. Or we could just spend some more time down here right now finding the Nern roots. There's gotta be one. Oh shit. It's ridiculous. These things are weaker than the little balls. I'm not even joking. It's crazy. They're so much easier. Maybe that's just because they're bigger? So they're easier to hit or something? But fuck me. Oh. Ah. Okay, 7 out of 30, guys. So, oh shit. It's a fucking gold mine down here. It's crazy. Oh my god. Unleash my unrelenting force on the green orb. Why do you guys want me to shout at an orb so bad? What does it do? Does it like awaken a, an ancient evil? It's not really green though, is it? It's like yellow. It just looks green. Kind of. It's like emitting like a green thing. Is our bad guy up here? <laughs> Bad guy down. Bad guy destroyed. I don't know if I can even get in here, guys. Look, it's locked. It's locked up tight. Can't get to this big orb, whatever it is. I don't think I'm going to be able to shout at it. We might have to find another way in. There's got to be a way around. Right? Right, guys? There's gotta be another Nurnru around here, too. Oh my god. He's too good to pass up. Gently caress the orb. What does it do? Does it, like, crash my game? Is it like a troll that uninstalls the game? Crashes all my save games or something? Is that what happens? Chat really wants you to shot at an orb, but I'll donate 50 bucks if you don't. Okay, annoyed viewer. What does it do though? Does it spawn like um, the last boss or something down here? Okay. 
Well, chat, 50 bucks is 50 bucks. I mean, that's like a whole bunch of new teaspoons for my teaspoon collection. I can't really pass that up now, can I? He says don't do it, I'm not doing it. I won't do it. Oh, shit, there's another um, farm overseer's house. I like it down here. It's really cool to explore all this. Look at this. What a fucking state this is in. I'm getting that feeling. You know that feeling you get when you're in a place and it feels weird because you know that there used to be a lot of life down here, but now there's not? What's that called again? There's a there's like a, a word for it. It's like called like fomanimanarnarnarn or something like that. Any of you guys know? Hide shield of waning magic. Toronto, the Ghiblis. Yes, the Ghiblis. That's exactly what I was thinking. Actually, that was the word I was looking for. Uh, tattered Dwemer cloak. I feel like now that we have Cloaks of Skyrim installed, we have to collect every cloak that we can find. And we've done good work here on that front today. Collected a couple of rare ones, I think, down here. I think so. Hey, annoyed viewer, thanks so much for the 10 bucks, man. I appreciate it. Is it, what, so, I'm, I'm a little bit intrigued, though, about this orb now. Whoops. The blizzard launcher just decided to fucking pop up right in front of my game and tell me that it needed to restart, which caused me to lose one arrow. Hey look, there's like a camp and stuff over here. This place is huge, fuck. The size of it. Look at, wait, oh, fuck, I can't believe how big this place is, it's nuts. Like a whole underwater kingdom. Crawling forever. I don't see any Nern roots over Sips. here. Yeah. If you use Fuchs Road, the orbit will spawn a special dragon boss. Please ignore that donator. Right, okay. What's so special about him, though? What's so special about that dragon boss? Is it just a dragon? You just get a Majol. Where the fuck are you right now? Come on now. You can't just leave me hanging down here. With all this... I'm at full carry weight. You can't just leave me hanging like this. I can't get the hell out of here now. What? What? The chat is the, <laughs> the worst. Wait, guys. So what, you fools throw down the orb and it spawns a dragon? It's not that great. God, it's not that much of a spoiler. I mean, if you fools throw down the orb and it, like, you know, Michael Stipe appeared and gave you, like, a million bucks, that'd be kind of cool. But, like, just a special a dragon boss? Who cares? Who cares about that? Anyone? I can drop my two normal pickaxes. Oh, shit, do I still have them? It's a cool encounter. Oh, okay. It's a Michael Stipe dragon. Oh, shit. Okay, well, now. Now that you, now that you say that, okay. Sure. Sure. Honestly, though, guys, I would have never gone up to that orb and Fusro dot it. Not in a million years. I really would not have. I don't know if that... What's pickaxes? Oh, yeah. Because we've got the notched pickaxe now, right? Good show. Good show. Oh shit. Got some baddies here. Hard. 
I bet you he's not using Valmer arrows for fuck's sake. Jesus. I bet she's not, you know. The chest. armor look at this fucking glass armor I don't think I've ever even seen glass armor before that's nuts that looks so cool if we can enchant that we can get fucking Majol to wear it maybe instead of the blades armor that looks really neat glad we came over here I'm really happy okay there's like a tower here maybe it's another lift Another geo vein. Fuck me. I've seen ten different glass arbors, have I? I don't remember. I don't remember that. Wait. Was that a nerd root that I heard? Or was it just part of the music? My mind's playing tricks on me now. Here's one. What the hell is this place? Is this just another elevator? Oh no. But look, there's a chest here. There's a little chest in here. Oh, this is where the Elder Scroll is. Of course, yeah, I for Yeah, of course we're down here to find- Haha! <laughs> oh, that's hilarious! Here we are! Oh, we're down here actually trying to- The Tower of Mazark. Oh yeah, of course, we are down here for a reason, guys. That's right. We came down here <laughs> Oh, that's hilarious. Oh, we're here for the orb. Plenty of time for the orb after. I don't know if I'm gonna have time to do the orb. I'm gonna have to go pretty soon. Ah, oh, grand soul gem too. Nice. Lots of, lots of nice treasures down here. Buried in the depths. Oh, lots of scroll of candlelight. Scroll of muff. That's good, right? It's just the scroll, but it's a start. I don't have the book of Muffle. I'm still looking for the Muffle book. The Armorer's Challenge. These are the most dangerous, but the most profitable types of ruins. The dwarves. I know. Oh shit! What was that? A prosperous race. Here, come here. Come here, Majul. I'm itching for a fight. No problem. You're gonna I have to carry, carry some of this of crap. Beer. Holy shit, I am carrying so much junk, it's insane. Um uh, old Hogan. Please give to Majol. Um uh, um uh, some heavy stuff. Oh my god. No wonder. Here I am carrying fucking a million All dragon set. scales and bones. I didn't even realize I I had those on me. I'm so sorry, Chad. God damn. God damn, I'm the worst, aren't I? Whoa! Look at this thing. It's a big old sphere. What kind of secrets exist inside said sphere, I wonder? Oh shit, I went the wrong way. <laughs> Fuck, of course I did. Of course I went the fucking wrong way. Son of a bitch. Let's sneak up, just in case. Just in case the last boss of the dungeon is up here. Like old Beardo or something. 
or that expedition. Ah ha ha, I've been imbued with great power! Ah ha ha! I can do spells now! Ha ha! Zap zap, you're dead in one shot! You can tell I played lots of video games, huh? Oh, uh, we've been in one of these before, haven't we? I think the one that we were in was like much smaller though? This one seems fucking huge. Okay, we put in the lexicon receptacle. Now, we just have to activate all the buttons. Oh fuck, is this like a puzzle or something? Journal of Drocht. I weren't never one for writing about my life. The king priests of old deserve their stories told, but Drocht is a simple man. So this is no journal. I'm not telling any stories here, but this infernal machine done worked its way into my brain space and I won't leave till it's figured out. The whole contraption just sets like a dead horker if it doesn't have the box. Putting the box in the hole made it all come to life. Five rings, but only four buttons? Most of them don't work most of the time anyhow. So when the lights line up, more open. But they don't seem to help. Just make another damn thing move. The old flea bag Kajit, what sold me this cube, said something about the light through the knowledge through the machine rests on the cube. I remember because he made me say it back at, at him when I wanted to throttle him. So I did. I tried to leave, but wolves but wolves to the top and them eyeless freaks outside the tower. Gotta stay here till I get it right. And I will get it right. It's something about lining things up. You gotta line things up? How do you line things up? You gotta line up these? And then it opens more buttons, apparently? Alright. Let's see if we can do it. Hold on. So we press this button. Okay, there's no lights now. Wait a second. What the hell? Oh. oh, no way. That takes you right back to Skyrim? Fuck, that's crazy. You can actually come down this way, too. That's nuts. Is there, like, another book or something? Majol, please. Please, come on. I'm trying to figure out this puzzle in this room right now. Okay. So press this button. Aha. And then maybe this one again. Okay, that's as far as that one goes. So this this puts it back up one. And then to the right. And then to the right again. Oh, something's happening to it now. to 
something there. Aha! doing but Jesus yeah yeah eat the cube okay yeah, I will I will do it I can actually read the cube nice open the tower of Mazark I don't want to open that I want to open this that holy shit so wait if I want to come back here now I can go to the tower of Mazark and come back here whenever I want I can go back down into black regional problem that's fucking great. Holy jump. Jump in Jehoshaphat. That's great. Okay. Good. Majol, follow me. We're going back home to say goodnight to everybody because it's late. Oh man, it's kind of late actually. Okay, listen. I gotta go, but I'll be back tomorrow for some more. Uh, I'll come back tomorrow and we'll, um, we might go back into Blackreach actually because I really enjoyed that. But we can also uh, carry on the main story because now we have the, the... Pa! You're home! Did you give me a present? I, yes. I sure did. Wow, really? What'd you get me? Um, I got you a honey nut treat, son. Thanks. Thanks. No problem. My kids are so easy to please, aren't they? It's crazy. Nice. All right, so listen, like I said, tomorrow we'll be back, um, but I'm going to stop now. I'm going to stop playing now. I'm going to save the game, uh, and then we will come back tomorrow uh, when I stream again, okay? Let me just make sure that that's saved properly and stuff. It looks fine, actually. Okay, good. Uh, so listen, if... Uh, hey, Sips. Hey. Really approve your choice of game, but... What? What happened to my beautiful voice? What? I was just about to roleplay as a sexy female secretary. Right. Now I sound like some oaf. Right. From village, shave my ass. Oh right. well. It's your choice. We'll still donate. <laughs> Sirem go. Wish well. <laughs> Loud pussy farting sledger. Always a pleasure. Thanks so much for the donation. Listen. Guys, if you're only here for gameplay, I'm leaving now, okay? I'm going to do shoutouts for uh, donations and subs and resubs for the next five or ten minutes, and then I'm going to leave. So, um, if you only want to watch me play a game, uh, I'm done for now. I'll be back tomorrow. Please join me tomorrow for some more. I'll be back around the same time. It'll be around sort of like noon, 12.30 GMT or whatever, uh, and, we'll, and we'll carry on, okay? Um, but if you are leaving now, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for donating. Thanks for subbing. Thanks for resubbing. I really appreciate it. Um, and, uh, and I'll hopefully see you tomorrow, okay? Thanks very much. Everybody else, step into my office and let's do these shout-outs, shall we? Oh, man. We got quite a bit done today, actually. We got a lot of the main quest line done, and then we did some other, like, bits and pieces as well, which was kind of good, wasn't it? Um, so that was nice. I, I enjoyed that. I had a really good time playing today. Um, the, the main quest line is very, um, there's lots of, like, talking, but... It's good. It's 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 really well done. Like the story is is awesome so far. I'm really enjoying it. So uh, we'll carry on and see see where it takes us. Sort of thing. Great. 